The bus stop here on Sutel Drive is an example of what more than 100 bus stops across Northwest Jacksonville now look like, according to Jacksonville Transportation Authority. There's a shelter lighting digital board with route information. Soon, some of them will also get a splash of color. JTA was a big part of my childhood. I grew up you know, a few minutes around the corner from here. Jacksonville artists are using their talents to tell Northwest Jacksonville story. Art will be featured at seven bus stops along the route from the Sutel bus hub to Harvey's grocery store, JTA says. Sometimes the, the stories you get, the narrative that people live with when they're not from here is that the north side is a horrible side of town, you know, and it's not. There's families here, there's communities here. Erin Kendrick is one of the artists whose work may be featured, the community voting on artists Tuesday. It's great to see the city shine a light on the north side. Mayor Donna Deegan says infrastructure and health initiatives are being prioritized in this part of the city. The mayor's office says lack of a personal vehicle is more prevalent in the zip code that includes Grand Park and Magnolia Gardens than in nearly 98 percent of the country. A lot of times when you're using public transportation like you're um, susceptible to the weather and it can be a very stressful experience sometimes so seeing something that brightens your day I think is, is very positive. Along with the bus stop improvements like shelter and lighting, artists hope this project will prop up a community they say is often overlooked. A JTA spokesperson says the decision on which art pieces will be featured at bus stops will be announced on Thursday. In Northwest Jacksonville, Renata DiGregorio, First Coast News, on your side.